this beginning experience of doing these trials has taught us we need to do rehab, we need to really pay attention to exercising all the patients, and finally, we know the treatment is safe. Um, I'm absolutely certain there will be better therapies than this. This is our just our first shot at this thing. And finally, we really have to solve the money problem so that we can go forward. And in the coming years, we'll be much faster, much more efficient. And I'm hoping that uh, the cure is on its way. I believe that I've seen such a change in each outcome of hypothesis of what you think is going to happen in each trial. And we're learning so much. So, and then once we get over this money hiccup, that's what's stopping us. Right. Well, I guess uh, what we really must do is we must keep our nose, noses to the grindstone. Yes. And, and uh, I mean, uh, the amazing thing is that we have accomplished all this so far. I just did an accounting. All the China SCI net trials we've completed, we've spent only two million US dollars. Wow. We've done five trials. Normally it would cost 20 times this. Um, we've been really frugal, you know, uh, just keeping Close tabs on everything. We've had, you know, mostly volunteers. All, you know, the doctors, of course, don't get any pay for doing any of this stuff. Um, and they are really uh, excited about it. You know, th that's one thing that that is so amazing. The doctors, the doctors really want this to happen. That is incredible. That they <laughs> want to do that and donate their time. Yeah, they're more excited than anybody else. <laughs> And, and we now have to bring this message to, to the doctors in the U.S. and the world. That's not inspiration. I don't know what it is.